for St. Patrick's Day, my aunt makes this amazing Irish soda bread. Kind of thought this covered it. Oh, okay. It's just I was missing that soda bread this year. That and my aunt's hot son. Ayo! <laughs> First up, me as a chef. Yummers. Firefighter. Whoa, somebody call 911. You mean 911? I did. Damn it, Jonah! I knew we should have finished the work, but you led us astray with your exotic flavored waters. We heard about you two. About how you don't want Myrtle to have a good afterlife. What? No. <laughs> there she is. I thought someone might have turned you into glue by now. Why? Because you're a horse. You know how they kill horses and turn their bones and hooves into glue? They do? Nope. Just being a goof. What about best wishes from your Cloud9 family? Um, family feels a little weird since a lot of us are banging each other. <laughs> Guilty. But I'm a creep. It's cool that Zephyr has a lady CEO. Or should I say, she EO? You don't need to, no. It is my privilege to award the golden vest to Kelly Watson. What? So going forward, do we talk once a day or twice a day? Uh, let's just see how it goes. Great. So should we meet for breakfast in the morning? Okay, you know what? If you're so fired up, why don't you go up to Sandra and demand the money back? Fine. Someone has to take charge. You go, boy. Yes. That's what I'm talking you're about. The man. Immigrants, we get the job done. We? My family is Swedish or something. There's enough for everyone. Just form a line. <gasps> Where are your parents? Amy is pregnant. The baby is Adams. I was the first to know because I am her best friend. And Justine, no one went to your bar crawl because you are unpleasant to be around. <laughs> unpleasant in bed. Uh, uh. <laughs> so we got put in the back. It doesn't mean we're worthless. No, I know. You're right. I, I just it just mean... means we're back of house people. Strong, silent, shadow people. The rejects. The freaks. Well, I wouldn't say freaks specifically. He's a super freak. Super freak, he's super freaky. Thank you. Do, 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 do. Okay, yeah, no, I Okay, full disclosure, I've never pierced anyone's ears before, but you've never had your ears pierced before, so we're in this together. So let's just close our eyes and go for it. So you made me take deer urine all the way down to their store Heat it up in their microwave and then dump it all over an innocent couch? How do you even think of this stuff? You're sick, Amy. No, I didn't! That wasn't- You turned us into monsters! Well, she made the list, so she probably knows who's on it. Yeah, Jonah, she's not gonna check it twice. She's not Santa Claus. <laughs> Dina. Hi, Dina. I was just coming to get some juice, but um, I think I'll just drink it straight. Okay. I love ice pops. Oh. Justine, what are you doing? Sex sells, Amy. Mmm, I can't wait to put this in my mouth. Mmm. Okay, stop. Oh, sensitive teeth. Um. You're, you're okay, you're okay. You're, you're more surprised than, than hurt, right? Not really. Tony? What's wrong? Did you see something in your eye? I'm gonna blow on it? No, Jonah fine. hit me. No, no. What? How dare you hit my son? Sandra, I swear. Does it make you feel like a big man hitting a kid? Uh, uh, <laughs> that's, all right, Sandra, joke's over. Most of these people don't get it, but I do, because you're hilarious. Do I look like I'm laughing? <clears throat> all right, Tony, I'll, I'll, uh, I'll catch you on the flip. Feel better, buddy. You touch him again, I will destroy you. She's not. I just wish they would catch the guy already. Why are you assuming it's a guy? Maybe St. Louis finally has a female serial killer. Oh, yeah, about time. 10 million. What? No. Dang, no, that's a nice payday. I'm sorry, a guy got his butt sliced off and we didn't hear about it in the news? Wait, so Carol could get $10 million? <laughs> okay. <laughs> that makes sense. The world makes sense. And early because Jonah doesn't feel like working? Yeah, and you wouldn't give me the day off to Skype with my boyfriend. The time difference with Ghana is so tricky. We haven't even gotten a chance to talk yet. Hello? It's your dentist's office that they want to confirm for tomorrow. Oh, tomorrow's no good. Okay. Um, he'd like to reschedule. So you just go on your phone. Uh, the survey's not on my phone. Just open an internet browser. 
Okay, I guess I can, um... I can't pay that money back. I'm living hand to mouth as it is. I always say, mo money, mo problems. That's what you say. You say that. Excuse me, can you help me find Carol Maloon? I'm her attorney. Hannah Conley? Well, hear this. Carol's gonna do everything she can to pin this on me, but if she wants to make this ugly, I will drag it all the way to hell. I think she's in floral. On your left, as they head towards the register. Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna get another Long Island iced tea, biatches! Woo! 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 <laughs> Diet Coke, please. Yeah, I miss her too. We used to go to the same water aerobics class at the gym. I don't want to picture your hair wet. No, we wear swim caps. Sandra, please. Oh my God, he's so cute. My ovaries are exploding. It's like scrambled eggs, anyone? Oh, no. Gross. Hey, keep your saggy boobs to yourself. Ow, stop. You stop. Listen. Whoever did was pretty awesome, though. Yeah. Superstar. Oh, rebel. Yeah. She's a badass bitch. Justine, <laughs> just go home. I have every right to be here. Hey, is anyone else tired of being humiliated by a bunch of idiots that don't even understand basic contractions? I'm so sick of this Sandra? No. Why don't you take your 10 now? Okay. okay. Obviously, we're not gonna just let them take Mateo, so somebody come up with something. There are no bad ideas. What about if... Okay, we... Sandra, could you just stop it with the wigs, please? Okay, Thank guys, you. guys, I actually think I have something here. In the event of an ICE enforcement action, anyone who may be in violation of U.S. immigration law should immediately present themselves to an officer for evaluation. This is from ICE.gov. Super helpful. So we're totally out of jetpacks? No, there were never jetpacks. Question, what does this mean for you and Jonah? No, this isn't about... N no, we're not. That's not what we're here for. Yeah, Sandra, besides, it doesn't matter. Jonah's seeing someone. Oh, well, that's great for Jonah. It's none of my business. It's my lawyer, and she's a redhead. So safe bet is she's like the filthiest freak in the world. Jonah, no. I Meant anything? I told him how Mateo and I are BFFs. Tay-Tay and Teen Teen, the slut squad. Wait, you talked to Richard too? Yeah, and I said how Mateo is always serving up the tea, like when he told that lost little girl that she was better off now because her mommy was hot trash. Classic slut squad tea. No, Justine, we're supposed to be proving that Mateo has good moral character. Why would you tell the lawyer that? Why do you want to work at Cloud9? Um, actually, I already work here. You hired me two weeks ago. I don't think so. I think I'd remember that. <laughs> You gave me one of these? I'm so sorry. It's just that you've got such a forgettable face, you know? I'm, I know. I think you'd make a great spy, though. Yeah? Yeah. OK, let's start by hearing everybody's work experience. You first, Justine. Oh, OK, well, um, I have worked here for over three years. And before that, I was a dog groomer. So I guess you could say I am good with hot-tempered bitches. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm very nervous. So you know how me and Carol hate each other? Well, I hate her, actually. She looks up to me. Anyway, I paid four different guys to come into the store and ask her out and then never show up. Nice. Funny to think that it has genitals, right? It's like I could have a stranger's tiny penis just whipping around inside me. Sounds like my Saturday night. Oh, my <laughs> God. <laughs> Next up, we're running short on reusable bags. Oh, we can just use the ones under Mateo's eyes. Oh! <laughs> Savage. Mm. Hey, I got you a little congratulations gift for getting your ankle monitor off. Some fun socks. OK, great. Just drop them on the ground and walk away. Thanks so much. Oh man, fun socks. Text me a pic. Why is Eugene in your office? Diane, why, why don't you come with me? Yeah, I guess. But I call dibs on any loose shrimp. Deal. I'll come too. Girls trip. No. St. Patrick's Day, 4th of July, my first Mother's Day. I'd always dreamed of going to Sweet Tomatoes and hitting that salad bar, soups, serve yourself for you. I don't want to talk about it. You know, over the next 20 years, that's $1.8 million. So I don't think anybody would blame you if you were a little upset. No, I'm fine. Hey, but do you feel like a BLT? I do, because I'm covered in mayonnaise. <laughs> BLT. Oh, my God. I am literally dead. <laughs> no, Justine, it's not funny. He's a miserable man, and it's a terrible job. Clean that up, dork. 
Uh oh. Clean up on aisle. Have what she's having. <laughs> Stop. I'm going to pee my pants. Well, if you do, I'll clean that up too. <laughs> oh, it's happening. Oh, good. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Not again. You already gave out all the bags? They were out of control. I said one per kid, but Amy, some took two. Benefits. Benefits. Good. Very good. Unionization. <clears throat> Can't say the word. This isn't taboo. Incest. What? It's taboo in every culture. What are you guys talking about? Nothing. Nothing. So you guys are just in the hallway saying nothing. We were talking about... Yeah, the... Jonah's going to a barbecue, and he has to be interesting to put burrata on a burger instead of provolone. And I said, who uses provolone? <laughs> <laughs> he was laughing, and then I started laughing. And then he asked, are burgers cliche in general? And I said, no, not if you use venison. But then you said, venison does not pair with burrata, so here we are. Yeah, and, and, then, you, and then you came up. Mm -hmm. So. Well, I'm sorry I asked. Okay. I'll, I'll see you around. Ugh. Wow, you are an incredible liar. Thank you. I think she'd have to Gone Girl Jerry. What's the one with the girl on the train? The girl on the train. Right. Maybe she's going to do that to Sandra. All I'm saying is that unions aren't always right, and corporate isn't always wrong. That's not what you said when they made you come back to work two days after having a baby. Yeah, you were living la vida pissed. St. Patrick's Day, 4th of July, my first Mother's Day. I'd always dreamed of going to Sweet Tomatoes and hitting that salad bar, soups, serve yourself for you. I don't want to talk about it. You were killing it this morning. When you said that protection thing to Cheyenne, I legit peed a little, and not even that little. Oh. And lastly, we're launching curbside pickup today, so some of you are going to be working on that with Dina. OK, those on curbside with me are Sims, McNeil, Thompson, Sikowitz, Vasquez, Bradley, Kaluio, Kalani. So you hired a whole outside team for this? Those are our last names. We have a Sikowitz? That's me. Wait, do you know Ricky Sikowitz? He's my cousin. What? He's my cousin, too. <laughs> oh, we should probably stop doing stuff. Oh, yeah. I was going to say that, too. <gasps> Kelly! Hey, hey lady! Hi. Oh. <laughs> Hello. Oh, no. You two are wearing a couple's costume. Oh, oh I guess well, it does uh, funny. Like that. Well, one of you definitely has to change. Oh, Kelly, you can switch costumes with Amy. Wait, no, that's not going to work because Amy's so much bigger. OK, Sandra, we're good on the Nothing forced. Sounds like it. Eric Sosa. He sounds hot. He's gay, Justine. Look all around. I'm going to pass my car. I don't even care. I don't want to go to the party. Sounds like a spam account, so maybe wait until your lunch to DM Prince Harry back. You're right. I shouldn't seem so desperate. Mm -hmm. Happy Valentine's Day. Ooh, I thought you weren't seeing anyone. It's not, I mean, it's kind of a, just, it's complicated. <laughs> what are you laughing at? Oh, I was just remembering the time you wanted everyone to think you had a boyfriend, so you kept sending yourself Valentine's gifts from Jeff. I didn't send this to myself. <gasps> There's a card. No, wait, no, no. To my sandy bear, love, Antonio Lasagna. That's a, such a distinctive, real sounding name. It's Italian, probably. It sounds Italian. Anyway, you all have my cell phone number, but only call if it is a true emergency, like a fire or a big storm or a robbery, OK? What if a celebrity comes in the store, like, Alec Baldwin or Billy Baldwin or okay, Stephen well, wait, Baldwin? It doesn't matter which Baldwin. No, it's just, once I got out to California, everything just felt, and I don't know, I think I, I think I made a mistake not marrying Jonah. You think? Amy, could I say a few words? Um, okay. Screw management. So you've just been lying to your parents for three years? You're a psycho. You're like psychotic. It's like, re, 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 psycho much. So Bo went away with you that weekend? I thought his grandmother died. Foolish girl. She's alive and well. Nana's in on it, too. So they're still beefing? Oh, yeah. 
They're going at it. It's savage. I used to tell my parents I was meeting friends at Emo's Pizza, but really, I was eating alone at Emo's Pizza. This plan we've got, so everybody call everyone they've ever known, friends, family, whoever, just get them here ASAP. Um, actually, most of my friends live in Manhattan, so I don't think they'll make it on time. Yeah, okay, that's it, fine. They're in fashion. Mostly they work in fashion. Two. Hey, guys. Uh, so Jonah and I have kind of been dating. <laughs> okay. Hasn't that been going on for a while? No, well, yes, but we've been keeping it secret. Now we're announcing it. Yep. So, what do you want from us? He said bring two store reps, plus she yelled dibs so loud at that meeting. Oh, Jonah, little negotiating tip. Walk away so they know you're serious. When I bought my Corolla, I hid in the bathroom for hours. Hey, I'd love to chip in, but I'm still paying off that sushi dinner I had to buy myself. Okay, all right, Marcus is a pass. Justine? I've just got big bills on me. Oh, her, but other people might be... Wait, never? I don't know. I mean, I don't know where this I, is going. I, just, but I haven't thought about yeah, it. I haven't thought about it either, but it's a conversation we should have at some at point. At some point, Jonah, not this point. Live in La Vida, awkward. Wow, when everyone calls their friends, this place really fills up. Yeah, I called Jerusha, but she's busy. She's doing a fundraiser to buy Pastor Craig a second airplane. Ugh, I wish all my friends didn't live in Manhattan. I'm Sandra, and I'm a dirty slut who goes around stealing other people's boyfriends. Oh, yeah? Well, who's this? I'm Carol. I'm a jealous psycho stalker who can't take the fact that Jerry chose Sandra over me. And now they're moving in together, and they're going to be so happy. And I'll be alone, which is sad. And we have so much fun together, but I can't tell you who it is because they want to keep it a secret. I totally get it. My boyfriend wants to stay anonymous, and it's driving me crazy because he's actually perfect. Oh, my God, he sounds amazing. Thank you. Yeah, and obviously, I would like to know his name. Like, that would be ideal. But I have to remind myself, don't get too needy, girl, because he cares about you, and that should be enough. And, and when you think about it, it's hard to keep a secret. So if he's willing to do that, that means he cares about you more. Totally. Justine? We're going to have it all. <gasps> hey, Dina, a lot of people have questions about this email you sent. Really? Due to recent complaints, employees at customer service are hereby off limits in regards to flirting and or dating. Which concept are you fuzzy on? Our question is, why did you send it? Yeah, and did Garrett, like, specifically say something about me? Because we've been vibing for a while. So you didn't see it coming at all? No, I always expected her to kill me not to break up with me. Well, if you ever need a quick pick-me-up or whatever, you have my number. Yes, you've been very clear. What do you do when that feeling comes over you? Well, I put on a hoodie that covers my face, then I take the 47 bus line to a library in a faraway town, then I open a private browser on one of their computers and Google how I'm thinking of killing her to see what mistakes people usually make. Jesus. So I forgot to mention that Mateo is donating his liver to me. Because mine is completely destroyed. Give that vino to Mino. Justine, get out. OK. And we've done a really good job of organizing employees at other stores. Oh, I pulled so many digits. Because you were in charge of getting everyone's contact info. OK, uh, Justine, I would say that you should be able to ask the vendor when the shipment will be delivered without making a joke about his package. OK, got it. Yeah, I'm still trying to learn all your little quirks, so. You know, like these two. They had multiple couples costumes. I mean, are they cute or what? John and Kelly aren't a couple. Yeah, Jonah's in love with Amy. Wait, what? What? I don't know. That's Jonah. Is that true? It's true. I love her. I'm pretty good at hiding things. My girlfriend lived with me for an entire year during high school. My mom had no idea. I hid her in my stuffed animals like E.T. Why did you have so many stuffed animals in high school? Do we need someone to distract Glenn while we try to sell them? I can make myself cry on command. Watch. Well, it's not happening. Oh, wait. Here it comes. OK. Everyone look away. I'm going to pull out a nose hair. Uh, you know, I know it's not a perfect workplace, but we love each other here. <laughs> Excuse me, I've got to go stop the love. I mean, you might have nothing to lose, but a lot of us can't just say 
corporate and risk everything because Jonah needs a cause to fight for. Are you guys fighting? No. We're fine. Guys, don't fight. You okay? Oh. I'm the new fulfillment center manager, but I can only keep five employees, and I can't make up my mind. When I have a tough decision to make, I like to spend a Sunday on the bus, pack a little lunch, and just bus on it. Ah, Sandra, I can't get sucked into your bleak life, OK? I, if any of you guys don't have plans, I'm going to an anti-Valentine's Day party tonight with some college kids. Should be a ton of ween, and the flyer says no one will be turned away. What Sandra, are you doing? Can you please uh, not get up on the? OK. No, if you oh, could I, just, I just, Sandra. Management is trying to silence us. Oh my God. But our voices will be heard. No, nobody was trying to silence anybody. I think it's cool that Zephyr has a lady CEO. Or should I say, she EO? You don't need to, no. Oh boy, Mr. Hilarious at work. What are you writing? Um, well, you are about to see. Ugh, I love the creative process. I bet it's gonna be so funny. Here we go. I can't even imagine all the ideas in your head right now. I bet even the bad ones are genius. Union meeting tonight. Location TBD. Time TBD. Refreshments TBD. She's like a rebel. She's like a total badass bitch. Mm -hmm. oh my God, is Sandra an icon now? She's like a total badass bitch. Heard it both times, thanks. Then. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> Why the AM next to your name? Because I'm your assistant manager. <laughs> That's okay with you. I don't want to be presumptuous. No, you're in. I was going for like a cool, badass moment. Yeah, I got I... that. Good. Yeah. You don't need to do. Okay, you did. All right. Wow. If you want to crush some dong, call me. Sorry about that. I got lost hate watching a James Corden clip at the gas pump. Oh, I love him. He has a British accent, but you can tell he's not smarter than you. Hey, Marcus, can you tell Glenn what you told me about Zephra? <laughs> what? I didn't say anything about Zephra. If you heard something, it definitely wasn't from me, Marcus White. Now, about Zephra, what would you think? Um, who do you think is the one? Uh, hold on, hold on, sorry. It's actually super distracting. We'll just talk quietly. Okay, so I read something online about how Zephyr is trying to control our minds. It's all true, and there's videos to prove it. Just Google Zephyr, mind control, guy goes nuts at Red Lobster. Marcus told me all about it because of this weird thing that's been happening. Like, I've been shopping online for a new mouthwash, then I came to work and I got a notification on my phone with a digital coupon for SuperCloud mouthwash. Wait, so that's what the digital coupons are about? Yep. And then after I used that one, they sent me more coupons, so I kept buying the mouthwash just like they wanted me to. Thank you. You know, Kelly, you didn't have to change your costume. And you didn't have to say it was Jonah's girlfriend, yet here we are. Hey, sorry, I just took off my costume real quick. The cowboy hat was itchy. Oh my god, you two are Danny and Sandy from Greece. Summer loving, right? Amy, you need to go change into Leather Sandy right now. You're messed up. You're messed up. Whoa, this is intense. Okay, let's get really real about Cheyenne. Well, it happened. Nina dumped me. Oh no, really? Damn it, I'm so sorry. You guys were just at the Cheesecake Factory like three weeks ago. You looked so happy. I'm just gonna say it. Blaine is sexy, but he is not a good manager. G, Cheyenne will be handing out new protective equipment. Based on her history, I wouldn't trust Cheyenne with protection. Oh! oh. I may be a teen mom, but at least I don't look like someone put a Pixar character into a microwave. <laughs> well, you'd be DreamWorks, bitch. Oh. <laughs> Savage. Please stop. Ken, do you want to do the honors? Oh, six foot bubble, everybody. Watch your fingers. I just had these sharpened. <laughs> uh, Ken, on the count of three, you're going to bolt cut us into the 21st century. One, two, two three. three. Or. You know, since we put the lock there, maybe we have the key. Less ceremonial, but fine. Uh, that's my house key. This one's Graham Graham skate rink. 
This is my orange theory locker. Ah, yeah, key to the racist lock. Woohoo! Wow, so this is what equality feels like. Amazing grace, okay. how sweet. Come on, everybody!